everybody, it's your girl China Renee. Well, it is the holiday season and I'm pretty sure we all know how to gain weight during this time of the year, but I'm actually gonna give you some tips on how not to gain weight or not to gain as much weight during the holiday season. And what I'm gonna tell you is nothing extreme, nothing crazy. It's very realistic. I'm not gonna tell you to stop eating during the holiday seasons because that's just unrealistic. I mean, seriously, we all like to enjoy family time, dinner time, and all that stuff around this time of the year. So I'm just gonna give you some simple tips that will help you to not gain as much weight or any weight at all during this time of the year. So my first tip to you would be to eat breakfast. Breakfast is the most important meal of the day. You don't wanna skip breakfast at all, especially if you're gonna be indulging like during lunch and dinner and stuff. Don't skip your breakfast because you wanna start your day off with something healthy. Make sure it's something like oatmeal, wheat toast, you know, hard boiled eggs, something like that. But breakfast is important. Don't skip breakfast. My next tip would be to drink lots of water a lot of water drink waters before and after every single one of your meals it's going to help you to get full faster you're not going to really overeat if you're drinking water before and after your meals and plus it's going to help you with digesting your food my next tip would be to do 30 minutes of cardio per day and it can be something fun like dancing turn on some holiday music and dance for 30 minutes or you know take advantage of your your kids game consoles get one of the dance games and dance for 30 minutes you know like just dance or zumba or something like that have fun with it you know make it a family event have everyone come in and dance for like 30 minutes or an hour and that will help you to burn calories and have fun at the same time. The next one I would say is kind of hard for a lot of us during this time of the year, but really try hard to cut back on the bread. The bread is really gonna hurt you if you're trying to maintain your weight or you're trying not to gain weight. Bread is the enemy, <laughs> trust me. So I know it's hard to you know resist buttered rolls and Hawaiian rolls and all the good bread, cornbread and all the stuff that we like to eat during this time of the year. But my suggestion to you would be to have one piece of bread and cut it in half. Try not to put any butter or anything like that but one piece of bread with your meal and that's it. Like don't go back for seconds, thirds, fourths, six pieces of bread. I mean, like you gotta chill on the bread. If you can do no bread, then that would be perfect. Another tip I would give you, especially this time of the year, we're doing a lot of shopping. We're going out to the grocery store, malls and all of this stuff. Park as far away from the door as you can. That way you can walk off some of those calories that you're gonna be putting on just do a little bit of extra walking walk you know a little bit more in the malls a little bit more in the shopping centers walk walking will definitely keep your heart rate up and it'll keep you from gaining too much weight my next advice would be to wear a corset a waist training corset waist waist trainer whatever you want to call it i like to wear mine while i'm eating because it helps you to get full faster like you really won't overeat once you're full you'll stop eating because you know you're being kind of sucked in at the waist and in the stomach and it kind of restricts you from overeating so i would definitely advise you guys to you know the women they make them for men too but to just wrap your stomach it could be one of the wraps with the velcro straps but wrap your stomach while you're eating dinner because it'll help you to stop when it's time to stop eating like you won't keep going a lot of us overeat and we don't even know it um, another tip would be to keep fruit in the house there's gonna be a lot of company there's family friends everybody's gonna want to feed you this time of the year so keep fruit nearby especially for snacking don't go snacking on you know a ham and cheese sandwich pick up some fruit instead Keep a lot of fruit in the house this time of the year because you're definitely gonna wanna snack, but you need to make sure it's something that's nutritious and something that's not gonna be really harmful to you. Uh, my next tip would be to pile on the vegetables. When it's dinner time, you know there's gonna be a lot of meat, a lot of unhealthy stuff, turkeys, hams, dressings. So just add more vegetables to your plate instead of you know more mac and cheese or more dressing or more 
candied yams. <laughs> Try to get more of the vegetables, the corn, the you know greens, the green beans. Add more of that to your plate so that would be more filling to you than the other stuff. And my last tip to you would be the desserts. You gotta chill on the desserts. The pies, the cakes, the cookies, all of this stuff is full of sugar, butter, flour, all of the things that keeps you bloated and all of the things that will make you gain weight. So I'm not saying don't enjoy any of the desserts this time of the year. However, try just doing like very small bite-sized pieces. So if you have a cake, try cutting it into like a one inch square so you can just taste it. You're tasting it, but you're not gonna have like a gigantic slice of cake or pie. And you know, you'll be killing yourself. You wake up in the next two days and you'll be like, God, I really should not have eaten that cake. So you can taste the desserts, but make it a bite-sized piece. If you go to like a buffet or something, you know, they cut little bitty tiny squares out of the desserts. That's what you should do when it comes to desserts, okay? But again, my most important tip would definitely be to drink a lot of water. Keep the water nearby. That's gonna keep you full and you're not gonna overeat. Get the 30 minutes of exercise in and drink a lot of water. And that's gonna help you this time of the year. Also, I don't know if you guys know, but I do have a meal and workout planner that is available right now on my site. And I wanna offer that to you guys now. Go ahead and get it because by January 1st, I'm pretty sure everyone is going to hop on the I need to lose weight, you know, journey. So get a head start now. Don't wait until January 1st like everybody else. <laughs> Go ahead, get the planner, and the first 100 people who get the planner starting today, I'm gonna be answering your questions personally that you have about weight loss or weight loss journeys, anything like that. So. Go ahead and get your planners now. Have a happy, safe, and healthy holiday. Enjoy your family and your friends, but you know, don't get fat. That's what we all want, right? None of us wants to get fat this time of the year. So hopefully these tips help. If they did, make sure you give me a thumbs up down below. And if you wanna see more fitness videos from me, please let me know, comment below, send me a request, let me know what you wanna see, especially with the new year coming up. I know a lot of us will be working on these bodies and getting ourselves back into a healthy lifestyle. So just let me know what you wanna see. And thank you all so much for watching. I will see you guys soon.